Hello. Hi. Hi, Ange. Guess what? What? My mom's birthday is coming up soon, and I need some help with a gift. Can you go shopping with me and help me buy a present? Sure, I'd be glad to help you. What day is good for you this week? Well, let's see. I have an interview on Monday. I have two articles which need to be written on Tuesday. Wednesday morning is open, but you are at work. Wednesday night, I have to be at the library. Thursday morning, I have a meeting, and on Friday, my friend is coming from London. I will pick her up from the airport. Wow! I had no idea you were so busy. I thought my schedule was busy. Ah、oh, yes, Saturday and Sunday you have your other part-time job. Did you forget? Yes, I forgot for a minute. Okay, of all the times that you mentioned, it looks like you are not busy on Thursday afternoon and evening. Is that right? Yes, Thursday afternoon and evening are open. Well, let me see what my schedule is. I have school every day until 3 p.m., and then I have my part-time job at the shop on Saturdays and Sundays. On Tuesday after school, I have my drama club, and Tuesday night I have my language tutor at my house. Friday, I'm going to a concert with Alexi. It looks like Thursday night is my best night to meet for shopping. Okay, then it's Thursday. Let's go shopping on Thursday. Well, what do you usually do on Thursdays, Carrie? Well, on Thursdays my meeting doesn't start till eleven a.m., so I like to sleep in a little. I usually get up around nine and then read the paper in bed. Then I take a shower and get dressed. After that, I go to the great bakery on the corner and have a coffee and something to eat. That sounds like a nice morning. Yes, it is really relaxing. Once I have my coffee, I look over my notes before the meeting, and then I meet Bob, my photographer, and we go to the meeting together. How long is the meeting? The meeting is three hours long, so when we finish, it is usually two p.m., and we're usually very hungry. Me and Bob have a quick lunch at a restaurant, which is close to where we are. And then you are free? Yes, the rest of the day is mine. It's the best day of the week for me to do things for myself. What do you do on Thursdays, Angie? Well, my day is not nearly as interesting as yours. First, I get up at six thirty and make some coffee. I turn on the news and make a little breakfast. After that, I shower and pick out something to wear to class. What time do your classes begin? Well, our classes start at eight thirty. So usually, I meet Jack in the corner and we walk to English time together. I have three classes all before noon. What about the afternoon? I have no classes in the afternoon. What about after school? Well, sometimes I work and sometimes I am free. It is a good day for me because I have the afternoon and evening free. Well, I'm glad we will both be able to meet on Thursday. Yes, me too. What time is good for you? I think that 4 p.m. would be a great time to meet. What about you? 4 p.m. is fine with me. Where? Let's meet at the store. Well, now that we have our schedules organized, the rest is going to be fine. Yes, I look forward to meeting you at four on Thursday. Thanks for agreeing to meet with me on Thursday. No problem. That reminds me, I should be getting a present for your mum too. Well, we'll have fun, and it will be great to see you. I know. With our busy schedules, teaching English classes, part time at Nike, tutoring at home, and writing papers for English time, we hardly see each other. See you on Thursday. Bye, Angie. Bye, Carrie.